Conversations Plus with Matt Rappaport post showed a BAM conversation with Matt Rappaport. We had a special guest, his name was Joe the Frawl, Sprawly. He's got big guns, look at that. There is, and he's got a roommate eating something. Probably cereal. What are you eating, bro? Cereal. Guns. He's eating food. Oh, and Jackie's on his back. He's eating foods with your warm milk. Mike Searle, past guest, he's here. Welcome, what? Mike. Let's get the beer. Mike Stinger, past guest, is here. Without a hat. Peter McDermott, past <laughs> guest, also here. Not here. And Rohan, maybe future guest. How are you doing? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> maybe. My name is Matt Rockport. What's up? So we had an awesome show. You missed Jackie Zahn. Jackie Zahn, who looks very... also here. By the hey, way. Jackie. How, how are Hi. you? Jackie. I don't think I've ever hung out with you or Rohan. That, that's cool. I'm pretty much awesome. That's all you need to know. That's enough. Wow. What did you say? You, you I like you already, Jackie. <laughs> Jackie uh, masturbates to the tears of 12-year-old boys. She's not alone. She's not alone. That's basically what she does. Not alone. And also, Bobby Joe Woods will be here momentarily. That's what she looks like right now with the Conversations logo. Yeah. So, so you're Joe Paterno. <laughs> Uh-oh, Joe Paterno jokes. Too soon? Too soon. I don't know. No. No. Uh, <laughs> and well, we <laughs> Low power, season one of the tester winner over here. <laughs> I see you right, right. We can see your Verizon logo, Joe. So that's that's interesting. That's the first time we can see that logos. Had, it's on my left breath. Brand pages have come to Google Plus and they've come to your T-shirt too. So look at that. So, all right. Hey, so Joe, so thanks for being a guest. What's up? What's this whole Google? What's this whole extra with Matt Rappaport thing about? What do we do now? Now we talk, we hang out, we, people ask questions, we get into conversations about Google Plus, about games, about anything that comes up. So first thing I would probably, uh, those people that are watching the show, like if they want to ask any questions that weren't answered, Mike had a few maybe, or of video games, of, of Arnold Schwarzenegger, of Bruce Gava. Do you feel a Boston is here? Yeah, he does. We didn't even get to the, the Boston What is party, up, Bruce? Joe. Bruce, you're on Conversations Plus. Welcome. You mean last stream now recorded, and you fell apart. Bruce, Bruce goes instantly. Bruce, Bruce goes instantly from very angry to very happy. <laughs> He's like, "Whoa, Bruce I'm on TV, like... ma!" <laughs> I was in the middle of doing some posts, and I got an invitation to hang out with some of my friends, so I. I jumped in not really knowing what to expect, and all of a sudden we're live. But you know, Bruce, that's what it's all about, not knowing what to expect. Uh, and I didn't have a clue. Yeah, and I, I'd like to actually say that this is this is one of the more intelligent groups I've had in a while, collectively, so very, I applaud that. Do you need me to leave, Matthew? Thank you. No. With frolls. Hey, uh, the more Irish people in here, the better. I think everyone in here is almost Irish, almost. I think uh, almost Irish eyes are smiling. I think everybody... I get, yeah, you're, you mean you're the exception, buddy. I think everyone else is Irish, right? <laughs> anyway, it's all My good. My Irish brown eye is smiling. Sweet. So, so since we have wow. so many Irish people in here, tell me why you're all obsessed with alcohol and potatoes. What? <laughs> That's a way to get everybody to stay. I don't know. That's somebody. Rohan looks like an alcohol and potato oh, guy. Of Joey, course. Jackie. Hey, so Joe just, we just had a chat with Joe. He's a no, gaming. I'm here. He has a gaming podcast. He's a funny guy. He does an Arnold Schwarzenegger impression. Uh, and he's been hanging out for a while. Uh, we talked about... I've literally been resorted down to the Arnold. Are we going to run to the like chopper? Can we run to the chopper? Get to the chopper. Get to the chopper! <laughs> uh, it's usually... Uh... Yes! <laughs> Joe's like, I have more to say than just my impression. You bastards. I mean, he really doesn't know. <laughs> Jackie, do you know, do you know him in real life? Jackie's on. Yeah, uh, we've met a few times. <laughs> oh, so so are we have like a date now, or using my show as a dating service? Just check. No. Okay. No. All right. No, I, I was curious to know. Very cool. Gee, so, so she. So Bruce, you're from Boston. You're from Boston area. Joe's from Cambridge. What? Uh, you have any questions about uh, why you both live? Would you still live in in, in that area, right? <laughs> why do we both live there? Oh, no, you don't live there anymore. You moved, Joe, right? I moved to Santiago. San Diego. San Diego. Oh, San Diego, in like. <laughs> I thought you were doing like a few good men, like private Santiago. I thought that's where you're going. He doesn't do a jacket. No, uh, a whale's there. vagina, right? A whale's vagina. Yes, Will Ferrell. That is correct. <laughs> yes. Yes, or Jackie's vagina. Whoa, uh, that's, that got that's personal. Actually, wow. that, that was the driest joke we had so far. What, though? 
That I hope that was sarcastic. Ooh. Oh! oh. oh. What he did there? Intelligence it's all over the place. It, it's spilling blood. I like the fact that Peter's microphone is about the size of uh, Rohan's headphones. <laughs> and now we need a three-second play and a B plug. <laughs> what? This is not a family show. It's it's late. <laughs> Bruce, I wouldn't be able to talk if that was the case. The kids are sleeping. <laughs> the kids are sleeping. Mike's got kids, right, Mike? I got one. Oh, that's no S. All right, sorry, my bad. Especially. Matthew, we want to ask. We want to ask Joe some questions. Matthew. Ask away, please. Peter McDermott. Mike, has a you've Mike, you've got a question. Why you've been burning gas, Mike. Go ahead. Which Mike? Yeah, which Mike? The one that exactly. has the question. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, which Mike? The good one. The one with the hair. The one with the question. The one that's looking at me. That's been on my show. That one. The one that what, what, the, what the heck? I'll just go ahead and ask Joe a question. What's your favorite? Uh, oh. What's your favorite game from the PS3? Right now, Uncharted Three. Oh, Uncharted Two was favorite. I'm actually happy with you. He is in the house. He's like, I'm not sure. No, let's, you know, I mean, hey, let's go. God of War. God of War. Is, I finished that one recently. So yeah, that. I, um, I don't know, Jackie. What do you think? Oh, does Jackie play the PS3? What, what do I think your favorite game for the PS3 is? She was actually on a video game podcast as well, by the way. Wow. What? Damn. Ooh, cross-promotion. I didn't no, hear what you said. You're on a video game podcast too, he said. Is that true? It's not a legitimate one. It's just me talking to my cat in my basement. Uh, that sounds like a legitimate <laughs> one to me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. Well, video game. <laughs> so, what, so Jackie, what's your favorite video game then? Um, uh, right one, now I'm playing The Witcher. Okay. The Witcher. I get to sex a lot of ladies. Do you enjoy um, sexing the ladies? I do. It's I've never felt more um, like a ladies' man in my life. It's really great. So now you know what it is. Nice. Now you know what it is we go through. Video <laughs> now I know how Frawls feels every day. Whoa! Every day. Whoa! I get some tension. Yeah, is there, wait, is there, you is you got co in that game for Rupert? Uh, what? yeah, we're friends on Sarcastic Gamer, and then, uh, we stayed in the same house at PAX, so. What was that like? Oh. Did you separate beds, though, right? Yeah, I had to lock my doors at night. Wow. Yes. What game That's you, creepy. Joe, what game will you play? GTA 4, or...? Uh. Um, let's find Ruby. Um, oh. <laughs> Remember, it's what called can I play? Sarcastic Gamer, not real people. I'm playing Uncharted 3 on the PS3 and just picked up the lovely Modern Warfare on the Xbox. Boom shakalaka. Thank nice. you for that one. So, yes. people, so people that are watching, do you guys, do you guys play games more than Google Plus? Is Google Plus a game, maybe, in a way? Do you find it to be a game? I think it's a game, sort of. It's my first day on Google Plus. Hey, wait a minute. Are you playing really? us, Matthew? Are you playing us? Not like, not like some, not like that musician Mozart is, but you know. Ooh. Hey, Rohan, what well, game hey, are you playing right now? Rohan, welcome to Google Plus. You're a virgin to Google Plus. Pretty sweet. He is. Yes, like my second hour on Google Plus. Whoa! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You just dropped into the All Stars. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> Although, let's be modest. We just, we're we're more like AAA. Did we just pop this AAA, yeah. yeah. Hey, Bobby Joe, we'd love to see you. Give that. Did we just pop, did we just pop the hangout chair? Yes, you did. Are you going to put your, are you going to put your bloody, um, your bloody... <laughs> <laughs> you put your bloody sheets outside to show your community that you just, that, you know, you're a you know, virgin. Are you a firstborn? Are you the firstborn by any chance? Anyway, Me? I was, I was, there was a Jew joke in there I missed. All right, so uh, moving on. <laughs> I don't. I don't think he's Jewish. I don't, I don't think so either. I don't think so either. But he said blood and show everybody, and that's what I thought. He really looks Catholic to me. Wait a minute. Uh oh, Keith Barrett has packed the room. Hello, Keith Barrett. You're on Conversation Plus. This is live being recorded. Welcome to the show. Hello, Joe Frawley was our guest. Joe Frawley likes to play games, and I believe. Uh, you Pick do enjoy your game, right, Keith Barrett, or or two? Or... Enjoy my games. You enjoy games. I'm always serious. All right. He's playing us. He's playing. I'm us. the only one without a 
I so feel like I need to go out and buy a professional. Are you talking about? You talking about video games? Video games. Uh, uh, oh, Bruce Gav is gone. All right, never mind. Keep going. <laughs> we'll live. Ball Matt, just pay attention to the chat. Okay. So welcome. Yeah. So Joe, do you? Are there any like? We didn't talk about kid games. Are there any like actual games made for kids? Video games that are enjoyable for adults? Or not really. I asked because I mean, Keith has a Disney you, connection. You, so we're not like, talking about like Barbie horse adventures, but I mean, there's a lot of games out there. I know. What? I love Barbie. You feel like there are all about the. Uh, dude, I mean, there's some pretty good rail shooters that are out there that are pretty fun that you can play, you know, that are for adults. I mean, a lot of these games out there, they just, they, they have a, an adult underlying humor to them. So, basically, if you play, like, Jack and Daxter, there's always something pretty funny in there that no no kids will get. It'll just go right over their head, but you'll enjoy it. So, you know, there's a lot of games out there. That's kind of an odd question. I know. It's a, well, because Keith works with Disney, so I thought I'd throw that in there. I don't know. Oh, all right. I didn't know that. Well, uh, the big Disney game was... Usually when I get those games, I usually get in a white van and have a whole bunch of candy. Whoa! <laughs> no. row. I'm like, we can enjoy wow. this game together. <laughs> It'd be great. So what are... What are It'd be it, fun. What, and so what are some of the games some of the other people in this room are playing? Anyone else currently playing a system or a game that's keeping their attention, or, or is it just Google Plus mostly? Anybody want to jump in? Uh -huh. I'm waiting for Diablo to come out. Whoa, dude. Diablo? Thank you? Yeah, Diablo 3? <laughs> mm. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. I know, I know. For That's me. what you said. Whoa. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, you did just say that. We all heard it, so... I uh, know. Um, <laughs> I'm all about seeing the obvious. <laughs> you are. So what about so what about pages? Does everybody have a page? Are you are pages annoying you yet? Are you are there too many pages? Pages are being used. No idea what that is. My I might I might brand my balls like on Google Plus. I think I, I think, think I think I think plus Joe Foley's balls already exist, but you can try balls too. Are you serious? Did you make this? Did, did you do an ode to my balls? <laughs> I should I should change it into ode to your balls instead of just Joe Foley's balls. But there needs to be a song called "Ode to My Balls." Well, when, when Adam Sandler returns my phone call, we'll get that going. Peter McDermott, you, you must have a mic him. control page going, on, all right? I cannot hear you. You are what? muted. Actually, I just started the new page, "How to Get Rich with G Plus." Yeah, I was just looking at that. <laughs> did you really? Yeah. <laughs> First, I'm talking about. It's a it's it's not a it's a fun page. Okay, no problem. It was good. To, well, good to see you, Keith. Thanks for dropping in. It was good hanging out with you the night, and and uh, hopefully justice was served. With Keith, the call me. <laughs> send it. Send us your send us your Mickeys, cause he cause he needs more Mickeys in his life. I love you. His rupees don't work anymore. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's a lot of Mickeys. He just looks like he's now. really good at hugs. I just want to give that dude a hug. <laughs> Literally. Like, usually, like, dude, I want to spend Thanksgiving at your house. <laughs> and just look I at your I will probably be at Thanksgiving at Disney World. I go to Disney World a lot. Disney, you're in Florida right now? Oh, yeah. I live 10 minutes from Disney World. Oh, my God. Really? So yes. what's the newest ride in Disney World? <laughs> Uh, that would be that would be the 3D Star Tours attraction that opened up. You should have said you. Uh, oh, that, that's a ride to, to take. Uh, it's different every time you ride it too. It's cool. Do you have like you a season pass? No, I'm just kidding. I I work here. Oh, you work at Disney? Yeah, World. he's the Disney employee. Woo, so Are you waiting for attention? What do you do for Disney? I work in IT. Oh, so you're not like a character at all or anything. <laughs> he is a character. I'm a character, but I still work at IT. <laughs> okay. You ever just want to like screw around with like it's a small world and just like jack it all up and say crazy things? <laughs> if he wants to leave. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna leave now. Oh, he's kidding, Keith. Alright. He does. Down. I gotta go anyway. Alright, like, thank, thank you. It's a small world. Thank right. you for dropping by, Keith. Like, what do you do? <laughs> <mean? laughs> oh, that was Keith Barrett, everybody, from Disney World, and Bobby uh, Joe has returned. I was gonna... Joe Frawley, I don't think Welcome Keith back, appreciated Bobby. the Disney. That's all right. So, what? So, what do you guys? What do you guys think? Do you think the pages are too much? Do you think that the fact that you can make, the fact that some people have made plus God, plus Devil, 
The people can make circle pages, fan pages, pages of pages. I made a directory of pages, page. Like, is it gonna yeah, be yeah, there's not really, like, any verification process, so people can create, like, a Walmart page or, you know, mm -hmm. whatever, right. if they feel like it. And, it, and right. so Google's going to have to go through and remove all that. Kind of like they do with the pseudonyms at the beginning. So do you think that this is a new this yeah. is a way for people to use pseudonyms by having pages like that, or no? Well, yeah, there's, I'm sure there's, they're going to allow pseudonym pages. Right. What is the strangest or coolest page you've seen? Anybody off the top well, of your head? Bacon. Bacon. I, I like sarcastic Wait, pages. We, I think there needs to be more sarcastic second? pages. Can we pause for a second and just explain yeah. to people who what pages is real quick? Sure, Joe, that's all you. <laughs> no, no, I want Matt. I want, <laughs> I want Mike. I want Mike, the social guy. Mike the guy Stinger. who literally writes blogs. Like, Mike, Mike Stinger over here, who, like, I click on one of my circles and literally I have to scroll for about 20 minutes to get someone else's post. So, Mike, why don't you uh, explain what Pages is, since you do it professionally? Yeah, Yeah. so Google Plus Pages, they're really not a whole lot different from, from profiles. I mean, people can circle them, like your, your profile. I mean... Uh, I, there's there like there's really not a difference between except much of a difference between profiles and pages. You can't circle except pages, they except pages are more specifically for business, whereas profiles are for people. Brand pages are for business. Well, That's so wait, I, I disagree though. Do you, you say circle? Do you think when you say business? I guess everything's business then, right? Because. Well, that, that's mainly what they're designed for, but of course people are going to use them for, for other things. Well, Just like people have used Facebook pages for things other, other than business, too. Right. And, and brands. Why is Jackie laughing so hard? I wanna, that's what I want to know. Because slowly going like this <laughs> and going off the, the thing, and I can't see him anymore except his does giant make, shoulder. Does that make you – wow. You like his giant shoulder, or is that just a no? Is just a fact of life? <laughs> And Joe Frawls has disappeared onto the ground and slowly looking for <laughs> signs of life. Oh. Joe, are you all right? What happened? It looked like you, uh, Mike's answer blew you away, literally. I found... What? Was there, that was a pregnant pause there. No. Found. Was, I actually, yeah. He just, everything he says just sounds like sex. Peter McDermott, we haven't heard huh? from you in a while. What's going on on your end? It's just interesting <laughs> to hear Mike, Mike Stinger um, talk about technology. Does that turn you off? Oh, that's good. Uh, all right, let's stop talking about pages for a second. You want to talk about... Whatever Jackie Jackie's does. Jackie's blagging out. Roha, do you want to chime in? Are you, you're new to Google+. Plus. What do you think so far? Is it awesome? Is it overwhelming? How does it differ from anything you've experienced? At an, well, I'm pretty confused right now what to do, how to do it, <laughs> where to go. But it doesn't mean you don't pretty like much. it, right? You still like it. You like it. You know? Yeah, it's, it seems pretty good, yeah. Confusion nice. is fun. It always is. It always is, especially when you're upside down. <laughs> Turned upside down. When you, did you do a barrel roll? Wait, where are you located, Rohan? Uh, Canada. Uh, oh. Well, that's so, where the accent comes from. Oh, uh, I'm Indian. <laughs> yeah, you, you, <laughs> definitely, you definitely look like no, you're no, wonder, no wonder your internet is so good. Now it makes all the sense. <laughs> no. He's like, I have to go in five minutes. I'm reaching it's my like, ten. <laughs> it's almost like over. Now. I'm almost screwed. Life. Bobby Joe, do you want to weigh in on anything? We've uh, pages or picture pages or what happened on the show or Your why Joe Frawley's page. roommate is so hot, something? I don't know. Yeah, where'd he go? No, my oh. roommate's high. That's, that's what I said. No, I'm, I'm just kidding. Up. No, I have to ask. Um, Joe probably said he was going to put a pickle in his mouth sideways. Oh, yeah. Where is your second pickle? <laughs> I mean, the one you were going to eat. Really? Not the one that you were going to eat. That would really manicured I'm eyebrows. I'm just saying, dude. You know? Don't, don't right, come. Well, don't, no pressure, but when you get a chance, they want the pickle. Uh, so let's go. <laughs> <laughs> <do. laughs> Take your time with the pickle. The warm I pickle. have one left. Yeah, we know. We established. So oh. There it is. Um, it's in there. It's, you know what's funny is you could have not picked a more wider pickle. <laughs> yeah. Peter Piper picked. Literally. It's a wide pickle. Right? You know what zesty means? Oh, snap. <laughs> you know what zesty means, right, Joe? Zesty? It'll explode in my mouth? I hope so. Mm, kind of. Maybe. 
No, I, I guess if you, if you do an Urban Dictionary search for Zessie, you'll see what I mean. Oh, I, yeah, I don't think that. Mike, Mike knows what's up. <laughs> Social Media Hour, Mike knows the deal. Hey, let's talk about this on Google+. Plus. So, people have been stealing other people's content in general on the internet for the longest time. And by stealing, they people go to Reddit and dig and they copy and paste pictures and other things. And they've been passing them off as their own content for the longest time. And it doesn't change on Google+. Plus. Sometimes people like to add their right. own comments, their own text, their own pieces. Maybe they Photoshop a picture. Maybe they make it sharper. Maybe they have their original. All everything is original, which is rare. Uh, there was a big incident yesterday, and by big, this I mean like yeah, I'm make this ten of us found out about it, or whatever. Maybe more than that, because Scoble got involved. But uh, a couple of things that were posted on the What's Hot, including a Michael Mozart post, uh, and not that he's always original, and he doesn't always credit, but that's another story. Him and Carter Gibson and a bunch of other people put up posts and Jason Calcanis of Mahalo Studios took those posts and instead of giving credit or resharing, he posted them as his own posts. And I heard this is nothing new. This is something that Jason Calcanis does. He has over 100,000 people following him. He is getting like pluses and shares even if he posts the word poop, so I don't really know what the difference is. Uh, but they made a big deal about it. So. Carter wrote a post, Robert McGee was so instrumental in calling Robert Scoble, and Robert Scoble wrote a post about it. Um, faster or funnier? I'm trying, I'm working on a body, I'm getting there. Uh, well, what the funny part was, Robert McGee sounds like Crispin Glover, so we want to see the pickle. Why, is the pickle ready? We can take a pickle break. I didn't know you were ready there, buddy. No, no pickle breaks, dude. No pickle breaks. <laughs> Uh, you, know what's, you know what sucks? I didn't know you wanted to ask me to do that because it's warm. What do you mean I asked you to do it on the, <laughs> on the show, buddy? Said, that was right out of the fridge. You were going to do it. You know what? I might put it in the freezer. You ever have a frozen pickle? That's, a personal, no. question. That's a personal question, actually. So, <laughs> anyway, there it is. The pickle, the pickle and the gun. The gun and the pickle. Yes, this hangout brought to you by Vlasic. Right. I literally feel like you're going to take this whole pickle thing and turn it into some gay joke. But, you know, we try to I don't we, we try to make sharing better or whatever. Like, you know, let's, you know, and people want to be shared. But do you think that this, <laughs> do you think that this was, was blown out of proportion? Or do you think this was something to talk about? Do you think that, that this, that Google. Wait, are we still talking about pickles? No, I'm trying, I'm trying to, like, finish my thought about this. You keep, you keep screwing it up, Joe. No, he's, oh he's, been, he's had it funny. Joe, if somebody stole your pickle, would you be upset about it? What? No. What if they ate your pickle and they said that they bought it, even though you did? Dude, I would be kind of pissed. Yeah, so that's kind of what. But what if, what if you stole that? What if the pickle they that they stole from you and ate, you actually stole from someone else? But if they got pickle? me more pickles, I'd be happy. All right. All right, that makes Just sense. Saying. He loves the pickles. It's all about the pickles, yo. So let's ask Mike, Mike Searle. Mike, what? You have a lot of artwork. Let's say someone copies and pastes your artwork and, and posts it, and they don't give you credit. There's nothing attached. You might be a little annoyed, but like you're, but technically it's still getting out there. What? How do you feel? Do you think that that? Right. I I've, I've thought about that. You know. Uh, no, he didn't. I didn't think about that at all. <laughs> I really don't think about that. Like, he thought about yeah, shaving. Um, too. He also no, thought about shaving. I thought about that because you know it's one of those things where if you put it on the internet, people are going to steal it. I mean, it's just gonna happen. Right. Um, and I think it's just one of those things. You either have to either accept it and move on, or not put it out there. Right. Those are your options. Do you think actually... Right, and, and a, a point that I was going to make is that this this stuff has been going on, like people taking other people's content and posting as their own. This has gone on since like the beginning of the internet. So, I mean, Google Plus is just a new place, and of course it's going to happen there too. I stole the content. Uh-oh. Bam. From, from Facebook. I just... I know that nobody from Facebook's going to Google, so I'm like, screw it, I'll right. use this I one. Think, one. I think we've done that before. <laughs> I don't I say I made it up, I just reposted it. Right. I'm just trying to share the wealth, man. So, so, so you're posting Farmville invites on, on Google <laughs> Plus? What's up with that? Oh. Yeah, you want to answer that question? Where's I'm going to my mafia hanging out. Whoa. Knocked off. Yeah. Zipped off. What about you, Jackie? Know. What do you think? You have any posts that have been stolen? You ever stolen a post? Stolen something's hard? No, I don't have anything interesting to say ever. Whoa. So That's not true. Wait, hold on. That's nothing I have is worth stealing. First off, do not subscribe to any of Jackie's feeds in Facebook, because you'll come home to about 20 of them. So they may not be interesting, but there's a shit. <laughs> she, talks, she talks to her cat in some of them, right? Basically, <laughs> it, it, it's like the other day she said something about her grandmother. I'm like, I don't care. 
<laughs> Aww. Well, I, don't like I found out that my grandma knows like what anyway, blanking is. Just to make her feel better about herself. Something about her grandmother and an <laughs> orgasm. I don't remember. Wow. But, I don't know how it works. But, you know, here's the thing about Jackie, though, just to kind of get into her a little bit, is that she actually works in a comedy store. She actually has some pretty, pretty good one-liners that get out there either on Twitter or on Facebook. So she actually does have some pretty good material that I'll have to hand it to her that uh, – it's it started some pretty pretty good conversations on Facebook, which I hope she brings over to Google Plus because it's Google Plus is a little bit of more of a uh, a more of a direct connection with your with your with your users because Facebook it just seems like someone likes it they comment on it whatever but Google it's like as soon as you post it you just see people just boom 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 it's kind of cool. My my mom actually had to. And uh, stop being my friend on Facebook because I was too foul and uh, vulgar for her tastes. So <laughs> I don't know. Like, like when, when no matter like she, her, she's so vulgar. No matter what she types in her iPhone or her phone, it automatically auto populates clitoris. So it's <laughs> like, like a mistake. It doesn't make. <laughs> it's the first word as soon as she opens up the chat box. <laughs> She doesn't even have to type anything. It's just already there. It is. <laughs> Waiting for her. Right there. Oh, <laughs> boom. Jackie, 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 did you add Clitter to your dictionary in Android or something? <laughs> what? Or I, what? Did you add Clitter to your word dictionary? <laughs> uh, no, I just, I can put it in there without even looking. Like, <laughs> do, you, do, do you have Siri? My <laughs> Are you using Siri? So, so, so Jackie. Oh, find, oh, I asked Siri, I said, find the Clitter for me. Please. <laughs> so, so if Jackie had like an iPhone 4S with Siri, every time she'd ask it a question, it would just respond with clitoris. Exactly. <laughs> that too. Exactly. And the G spot. Where is the G spot? <laughs> does it exist? Ja does a G spot exist, Jackie? Yeah. Yeah. Do you think guys should just know where it is on the top of their yeah, head? Right? It does. Bobby, does it exist? I want to know. I mean, I've heard. Uh, is there a male G spot? I've tried to find it. Uh, yeah, it's by the, it's by the, it's by the prostate gland. Yeah, that's why you gotta stick it in their ass. Whoa! Wow! <laughs> that, no, I was kidding. Yeah. Here's how you find a G spot on a man or a woman. You put your finger in there and you do the come forward thing. Wow. So and this has turned into the sex advice I found. So if anyone has any pointers or tips, feel free to share any sex. Uh, you, know, or tips. Why you don't need to yell. I know. I get excited. <laughs> Good so, Lord. Peter wants to know You're talking it all like God. Whoa. Peter wants to know about the clitoris on the iOS 5. There's an update, Peter. Hey, you're the guy to ask about the update, aren't you? Uh, did you update it already but on your phone? I didn't even do that yet. The whole 5.01. He's like, there was an update? I didn't see that. What? Anyway, I saw it before the show. I thought maybe he knew. He's all looking at him. He's all like ranting. Oh, God, I missed something. That's not good. Just kidding. I love you, Peter McDermott. I missed you. Where have you been all my life? I mean, the last couple of weeks. <laughs> I've been working on the uh, Muppets movie. Oh, shit. Oh, it's nice. Really yeah. It's been done for a couple Wait. of months, but that's cool. Peter, Peter I, should have, yeah. I should have sent you the hat so I could have got you uh, to give it to the Muppets to sign. <laughs> yeah. And so, Mike, my theory about your hat is, is that you don't want people to, you don't want to be known as the guy that wears the hat anymore. It's just not taking you seriously. You want to be known as someone serious, right? Is that the point? Is that why you're not wearing the hat? The guy not wearing the hat? Dude, put the hat on. Can we see the hat? Can you put the hat on? Put the hat on. Eh. Hey, Peter, what do you do? What do you do for a living? I think I'm a, a I, I mean, Micro Patrol. I need an answer in that. No, that's not, that's so defunct. It's. I'm so embarrassed by that. I, no. I'm a manager for a hospitality company right now. For what? For a hospitality company. I'm a sales manager. Ah, nice. He's also in New on. York. No, no, in Nashville. He's also had a you lot hiring? of cool interviews. <laughs> I've interviewed a lot of people here, but but you asked what I do for a living, I believe. Right, I know that's true. And what I would like to do for a living and what I do for a living are two different things. Like. I agree. Uh, Joe, do you make your living with the podcast? No, not even close. Yeah. <laughs> right. No, like I, mean, I, actually I, would, I would like you guys to be able to do that for a living, though, is my point. So that's, you know, and you're more interested in talking about that than your actual job, right? Am I right? No? Yes. Yeah, but now that I'm connected to Mike on LinkedIn, I think we're going to be okay. Yeah, we're going to be great. I'm, gonna, I'm sending you 10 grand via PayPal right now just to get started. 
oh, and great. to get started with, I don't even know what yet. So. Well, Mike, let me tell you what. Be sure to check out the new page on Google+, Plus: how to get rich on G+. Plus. We're going to be showing business. Peter, we'll making. partner up, and we'll, we'll, we'll create something amazing then. Yeah, Peter, ninety ten. Does that sound that good? I just circled yeah, that page great, great. as you myself just him? as my brand. Actually, uh, Mike, I think that was a typo. You just sent me a hundred thousand on PayPal. Ah, uh, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, just uh, just cash it. And before you cash, just send me the rest. That's what he wants. <laughs> send me whatever is left over. I'll oh, send Joe, you some pickles, Joe. Joe, I, j I just sent you a dollar. Thank you. Hey. And you lost like fifty cents of that from the transaction. <laughs> seventeen. Seventeen. It's eighty three cents now. Alright. Uh, math is hard. <laughs> and so is Joe Frawley. Whoa. Oh wow. Wait, uh, do you need that pickle or what? Speaking of hard. Thank you. Oh, you need that pickle. pickle. Oh we're in a pickle here. Pickle. We wanna see the pickle. And then what? <laughs> <we'll have pickle. laughs> Jackie. Wow. Jack, 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 Jackie has seen your pickle. Have you seen my pickle? We've all seen your pickle. You were wearing really short shorts. Oh. I Dude. That's wow. probably really true. I'm not going to lie. That's probably wow. not. Wow. That could be a true story. There's no sarcasm. Uh, Joe Frawley eats a pickle. And gets that was probably, days. yeah. She's like, I don't know what I saw. It was dark. Uh, just a fun factoid about Joe Frawley. He uh, sleeps with his hand down his pants. And no you know, way. You know that because... <laughs> because that's where he keeps he his PS3 together. controller. <laughs> <laughs> was, it just, was, it, was it just his hand down his pants? Or, or... Is that what they're calling penises now? Is it okay. PS3 controller? Yeah, oh yeah. Them, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you sleep with your PS3 controller in your pants? Is that what you're talking about? I don't know. That is Hold on, I'm gonna find it. No, you're the one holding on, but... So, exactly. hey, Rohan, do you want, does, does this whole thing want to make you hang out more, less, or the same? <laughs> it's pretty fun, yeah, enjoy it. Yes. <laughs> yes. You're a very sick man, Rohan. Would you say, would you say it's been a very warm experience you for you, Rohan? Very warm. It's very warm. Very warm. So, that's awesome. It's nice to know that, that Hangout Conversations and Conversations Plus can bring new people into Hangouts. Did you purposely come into this Hangout because you said, like, is this, did this make you want to hang out, the show format, or how did you find out about it? Oh my oh. god, it's true. I was following the forums. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear god, it's true. Sorry, go ahead. Ron. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm so jealous. I'm recording. I can't see that. I'll have to wait. How? That's... that's wow. <laughs> so now do you still feel as warm? You feel warmer now, I'm guessing. <laughs> Open up a window. Hot. Crack, crack a window. Really hot. Uh-oh. Oh, Bobby Joe's going to show us the picture. Here we go. Bobby Joe's... Oh, no! Uh-oh. There it is. Now, Joe, can, do you remember this moment in time or... No idea. No, no I was passed out, dude. I was... Uh, how, how much, how much anger had you uh, drunk? <laughs> Uh, I don't know, man. I just wanted to increase the blood flow a little bit. <laughs> were you were you digging for China or well, what's going on? I don't know. This change. This change. I don't know. I, you know what? I think there was three other guys in the room. I was just basically protecting myself. That's my defensive position. When oh, I thought. oh, you thought they were gonna roast shampoo you? I got it. Uh, well, I don't know what that is, but it what sounds pretty kinky. It's, it's not good. It's basically, it's, kicked, it's basically a kid, 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 kid kicked in the nuts. 